Hello everyone and welcome to my Sattvic kitchen. These crispy cauliflowerettes in mildly spiced pumpkin gravy is a vibrant addition to any dinner table. It's bright, flavorful and carries a hint of sweetness. Now this recipe may feel a bit bold if you haven't tried a veggie based gravy before, but you've got to trust me on this one. It's incredibly easy to make and the flavor is spot on. So I got my hands on this beautiful cauliflower head that I picked up from the farmer's market today. First off, remove all the green stems. Now flip the cauliflower so the stem is facing upwards. Cut the head in half. Now using your hands, break off large florets following their natural divisions. Wash the cauliflower florets, add them to boiling water with salt and leave it in covered for about 5 to 10 minutes. Remove the florets from the water and set them aside to dry out completely. In the meantime, let's prep the pumpkin gravy. Just look at that beautiful color. Fill a pot with some water and add in the cut pumpkin pieces to it. Cover the pot, reduce the heat to medium and cook for about 10 to 15 minutes or until the pumpkin is very tender. Remove from the pot and keep it aside to cool down a bit. Now in a pan, add some butter along with some garlic and ginger. We're gonna saute for about two to three minutes until fragrant, stirring continuously, making sure that it doesn't burn. Now add in the onions and saute for another three to four minutes. In goes some oregano, chili flakes, dried basil leaves, a pinch of white peppercorn powder and red chili powder. We're going to cook the herbs and spices for another 3 to 4 minutes on low heat, stirring continuously. Feel free to use spices from your region or whatever works best for you. Now transfer the tender pumpkin pieces to a blended jar along with the prepared masala and blend everything to a smooth paste and keep it aside. Let's prep the batter. Add some all-purpose flour to a mixing bowl along with a pinch or two of salt. Now add in room temperature water slowly until it becomes a smooth paste. I'm also adding some rice flour to the batter. Not only will this lighten the batter, but would also give an excellent crunch to the cauliflowerettes. Give it a good mix until well combined. Put the cauliflower pieces into the batter and toss until well coated. Once the oil has heated well, using your hands, start dropping the cauliflowerettes into the hot oil. We're going to allow these to cook in the oil for about 3 to 4 minutes until the cauliflowerettes are golden brown. Continue to follow the same process until all the cauliflowerettes are done. Immediately remove from oil and place on a paper towel lined plate to remove any excess oil. Transfer the prepared pumpkin sauce to a bowl, add some salt to taste and squeeze the juice of half a lime. Give it a good mix. Pour half of the prepared gravy at the bottom of your serving bowl or dish. Arrange the cauliflowerettes on top. Pour the remaining gravy on top of it. Sprinkle with some lemon zest, black sesame seeds and garnish with some fresh coriander leaves. This vibrant side dish will certainly make a welcome addition to your holiday table. Do give this recipe a try. And for more such delicious recipes, don't forget to like, follow and subscribe.